Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I have a very exciting video for you guys. I have actually got another Sheen haul for you to watch today. I am so excited because I have got tons of different items in this haul. I've got like sweatpants, I've got some pullovers, I got some cute clothes rather than the last one I just had like casual wear. Um, I have a lot of different items so stay tuned because you'll get to see a lot of different variety of what I have picked out for you today. To give you guys a sneak peek, this is the box of stuff. It just arrived today. I placed this order about a week ago so with the amount of stuff that I had ordered I got free express shipping so that means it came in within a week. Usually if I just get normal shipping it takes about two and a half weeks but with the amount of stuff I got during this haul it came pretty fast. Also I want to apologize if it seems I have gone MIA. I have been very very busy this past week with getting ready for school because I start classes tomorrow and then I was just in a wedding this past weekend so this whole week has just been very hectic um, but don't worry because this is a video brand new one today. So like I always say please don't forget to like this video, comment below for any other video suggestions, and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So with all my excitement I have to get into this box today. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so from the last video, I got some dupe Align tanks, or I only got one. So this time I had to get more because I absolutely loved the quality and the way they looked. So this first item is the Globe Mode Feather Fit Active Tank in color Cadet Blue. I absolutely love this tank. This color is so freaking cute. I normally don't get any other colors in activewear besides black, but with how high of quality this material was, I thought I just have to get more colors because I definitely thought I would wear out the black until it was nothing but a thread. So I was like, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to get some more colors to switch it around. But what's pretty cool about this color blue is the lining on the inside is a light gray, whereas the black one, it was all black. So I think this is a pretty cute accent color for this. I mean, no one's going to see it, but just for me, I think it's cute. But this is what the front looks like and then the back. So let's try it on now. So this is what the dupe Align tank looks like on. This is the softest tank top in the world. Um, I won't say much about this one because in my very first Shein haul, I bragged about this one very highly, so I'm not gonna take up much more of your time on this top, but this is what the front looks like, and then this is what the back looks like. I love that it comes with a built-in bra, so you don't have to worry about slipping on a bra before you put this top on. So you can just go ahead and put this top on by itself. Um, it gives you tons of full coverage, so you can't see through this at all. It's very soft, buttery feeling. I just love these tank tops so much, and I think I'm going to go back and order one in every color. But with that being said, I give this a 10 out of 10. Okay, so this next item is actually a t-shirt. But when I saw this, I literally had to pick it up. These were going really fast. It said there was only three left. So as soon as I saw that, I was like, these are going fast. They might not restock because some items on Shein, once they go out of stock, they won't be restocked. But with that being said, this is the front. It says baby girl. And I thought the back was even cuter. Look at this. I absolutely love the vibe of butterflies. I don't really have any shirts or anything with butterflies on them. So I had to pick up this shirt and then I also picked up another butterfly shirt which you will see coming soon. I am just randomly grabbing everything out of the box. No particular order because this is the first time I'm actually getting to open this because it just arrived about 30 minutes ago. So I'm excited to see what I pull out. So this was that shirt. And let's try it on. All right, I am loving this t-shirt on. Isn't this such a cute t-shirt? I've never had a solid black t-shirt of any kind, which is kind of weird because all I wear is t-shirts. And for me not to have one black one in my closet, that's why I had to pick up this one. But this is what it looks like on. I love the oversized look. I love oversized t-shirts. This one is more of the cotton feel rather than the soft, smooth, buttery texture. But I really like this one because it's very airy. Um, I like how much room I have. I can like move around in this. This is what the front looks like. And then the back is my favorite. I love the saying and the cute butterflies. So I give this top a 10 out of 10. Okay, so this next item, just like the tank, I already had one of them in my first video, but since I loved it so much, I got a second one, but in a different color. These are the Absorb Sweat Breathable Sports Shorts in color black. 
So my first video I got white and I absolutely loved them. These are like the dupes for the Lululemon. And so I was like, I'm going to get some black ones because what if these white ones get dirty and then I don't have any more. So I decided to get these black ones. Super cute. Cannot wait to see what these look like on because when I'm holding these up, they look just like the Lululemon ones. I mean, I said that about the white ones, but still. I'm excited to try these on, so let's try these babies on. All right, so these are what the shorts look like on. I absolutely love these. These are reminding me so much of the Lululemon shorts. I love that these have a really wide waistband just because it sucks my stomach in, which is what I love about shorts or any type of pants. But these are the front and then these are the back. I think these are so comfortable. I love that it has these built-in spandex just for the extra layer of coverage, but these shorts are so freaking soft, and I think that these are definitely one of my new favorites. So with that being said, I give these a 10 out of 10. So I have another glow mode item for you guys, another pair of leggings. Okay, so these are glow mode booty illusion leggings in color black. So I tried on a pair that were similar or very, very similar to the Align leggings from Lululemon. And so these are, these actually remind me of the Nike ones. I can't remember what they're called, but they had a pair of leggings that did not have any kind of seam at the top. It just had a seam going up the very middle of the crotch all the way up to the waistline, which I think is super flattering and gives you the softer and flatter belly. So these also have pockets on both sides. So you have one right here and then one right here. And I really like the material of these. These also don't have any um, seams on the bottom of the ankle. It's just very smooth. And I really like that about leggings just because I don't know why. I just always have thought they looked very flattering on my ankles. But I mean, no one's gonna be looking at my ankles that close. But these are super cute. The quality is outstanding. Like I actually will start ordering all of my leggings now from Shein because these Glow Mode products are out of this world I have to say and I really like the back of these it gives you that little line above your booty to make it pop sometimes I don't know if that'll make it pop on mine just because I do not have that many curves but it's fine because these leggings super high quality the waistband is super thick like compared to the quality of just the legs versus the waistband it feels like there's 10 times more fabric in the waistband. So that means you will have a flatter stomach in these. So let's try these on because I'm excited. All right, so I have the leggings on and these are so, so comfortable. I would say they feel right around the other ones I tried on in my very first video. These feel just the same, but the only difference is these have a wider and thicker waistband, so it sucks more of your tummy pudge in, which I really like because some leggings, they don't help out my stomach at all. I just feel very insecure, and these, I don't feel insecure at all. I actually feel very confident in. They slim me down. I love how fitted they are. I think one of the things that helps that out is it has the seam that goes all the way up to the waistline. There's no seams up here. And then there is no seams on your ankle. So I really like that about leggings. I don't know if that really matters to you guys. But with these, they have pockets on both sides. So there's one right here and then one right here. And that is just amazing if you are like going on a run and you want like a place to put your earbuds or even your phone. I'm not really sure if this will fit your phone just because of how shallow it is. But it will fit other necessities, I guess. But this is the front of these. Super, super soft and very form-fitting, okay? And this is the back. I really, really like these. These are so comfortable, so I give these a 10 out of 10. Okay, so for my next item, this is another glow mode active wear kind of look. This is the Glow Mode Feather Fit Side Pocket Contour Tee in black. So this is another active kind of top. This is a very form-fitting top. So I kind of wanted to try this because not only does it have like the soft texture, it also has like a ribbed pattern on it. So you have the back, which is ribbed, and then the side pocket. So I think there's only one side pocket, but yeah, there's only one side pocket. I'm not really sure what it's gonna hold because it's pretty small, but I'm looking forward to trying this on because it is super soft. I know this will be good for like if you're going to the gym to work out. I think it'll absorb sweat pretty nice. Um, 
yeah, I'm super excited about this. So let's stop talking and try this one on. Okay, so I went ahead and just left these leggings on for this top just because they are both glow mode and I thought they would pair very well together. But this is what the top looks like on. I think I could have sized down maybe one size. It is a little baggy up here around my neck, but maybe it's just because I'm not wearing any kind of bra with this. Maybe it'll fit a little better if I have some kind of padding underneath. But this is what the front looks like. And then this is what the back looks like. I think this is a very nice top if you're gonna go work out. The only thing I have to say about this is maybe it's just me. I don't like to wear any shirt with a sleeve when I work out just because of when I sweat, it gets a little moist and hot up in here. But that might just be me. So if that doesn't bother you, I would definitely recommend the shirt if you're gonna go work out or go for a run or any type of active activity that you're gonna go do. But this is such a nice top. I really think it complements these leggings really well. And so I feel like I should just go on a hike now with this or go to like a spin class because I am ready. But anyway, I give this shirt a nine and a half out of 10. The only reason why I gave it a nine and a half is just because of how loose it is up here. But like I said, if if I put on a bra, it might fix that issue. Okay, so for my next item, this is more of a dressier look. These are high-waisted leopard pants. These are the leopard print high-waisted white leg pants and multicolor. So they had another color. It was black and white. And this one was like more of the brownish one. So I decided I think this one would look better with more of a white shirt. I mean, the black and white ones would look too, but I'm just a sucker for the more of the brown leopard print. But immediately when I took these out of the package, the quality does feel a little cheap. I'm not really sure how it's gonna look on, but it's kind of very thin, kind of very thin. It is very thin, but I mean, since it does have the pattern, I'm not sure if that would really matter because the only thing I'm concerned about thin quality stuff is if it's see-through. But with the pattern, I don't think it'll be see-through. But I don't know that until I try it on. So, I'm also very short too, so I don't know how these are going to be lengthwise, but we'll just try them on. So, I'm going to try these on now because I will not stop ranting about these. I've always wanted to get these. As soon as I saw these on their website, I was like, I really like these. And I've had them in my cart for a while now. So let's try these on because I cannot wait. Okay, so these are what the leopard print flared white leg pants look like on. I don't know if you guys can tell, but these are extremely high-waisted. Um, they come up right below my boob, and they still have about another inch of gapping down here where I can pull them up even more, but I don't want them to look like I have those giant pantsuits that those people wore in the circus. But lengthwise, these are a little long. They come right up below my heel, and so I think for me to wear these and not drag the ground, I'd have to wear maybe be like two to three inch heels but other than that these are super comfortable i was a little worried about the material and how thin they were but actually these are not that bad because i think i like the material and how thin they are because i feel like these would get really really hot if they were any thicker these are really airy so when i walk it feels like i don't have anything on which i really like so these could be good for summertime i'm actually really liking these i would suggest though if you have a little pudge right here like i don't know if you can tell but i have one I would wear spandex or something underneath of these. The only thing is the waistband is a little tight, so you might not be able to get anything under this. But if not, just wear like some high-waisted underwear with like a thick band. But other than that, I thought the material would make me not really like these as much. But actually, with them on, I really like them a lot. So I give these around a 9 out of 10. Okay, so for my next item, I have another pair of shorts. These are the breathable solid sport shorts in color white. So these are a little different than the other ones that I just showed you guys. These have a slimmer waistband and then these have some kind of pattern on the front. It goes down your um, mid thigh. It's like a line. I don't know if you can tell on camera, but I thought my dog just walked in you guys. What is it? Anyway, I thought these would look very flattering on. I love white shorts, so I had to Milo, what are you doing? Sorry, he keeps interrupting me. One second. Okay, I'm back. He just needed some cuddles. But as I was saying about these shorts, these are very nice material. They're not thin at all. I don't feel like they're cheap quality. They do come with some spandex lining. So if you have like any worries that they're gonna flash you, then you're protected there, which I really like about shorts because it also gives me like some more comfort because spandex under shorts make the shorts 10 times more comfortable. So let's try these on because I'm excited to see what these look like. 
Okay, so these are what these shorts look like on. The only thing I have to say about these is with the waistband being a little thinner, it kind of makes the top of the shorts flare out a little bit. I'm not really sure if you can notice that, but in the mirror, I feel like I look kind of awkward. I mean, that's just me. I don't think anyone else will notice, but I love that these have also built-in spandex. They have a small little seam design that goes up the front of your thigh, which is very flattering, but this is what the front looks like, and then this is what the back of the shorts look like. So I'm really liking these. Um, I would definitely say I like the other shorts maybe a slight bit better just due to the wider waistband. But these are very comfortable overall and I only have one pair of white shorts and now these are my second. So I guess if the first ones get dirty or unwearable, I can just swap over to these. But I really like them overall. So I give these a 9 out of 10. Okay, so my next item is also another item that I had in my first video just in a different color. These are the... Solid slant pocket sports pants, light gray. And the ones I got in the very first video were just like a darker heather gray. But the only reason why I had to get another pair of these is because the cuffed ankles at the bottom of these are like thicker than most joggers. So they look better on my ankles. I have very, very skinny ankles. So I really don't like the thinner cuffed ankles on most sweatpants. Just because they make my legs look a little fatter than they actually are. Which I already do have pretty wide legs due to my thighs. But I thought these were so comfortable. And I really loved the other ones. So I was like, I'm going to get another color. Which is the light gray. So you know me. Always buying duplicates. But... Hey, if this stuff is good quality, then you get really good products for your money. So, these are only $19 too. So, let's try these on because I'm getting a little chilly. <laughs> these are my all-time favorite joggers. I don't know if I mentioned that in the very first video, but that is why I got a second pair. But these are so comfortable. I literally feel like I have clouds wrapped around my legs right now. But they are fleece-lined, very comfortable. Just the outside texture is super soft. I don't know what this is, but it's like heaven. Anyway, they have pockets, and then they fit my ankles super well. They're not too short or they're not too long. So, that's what I really like about these. I'm 5'3", and so most joggers or any kind of pants, they fit a little longer on my legs just because I have really short legs and a really long torso. So these actually fit me very nice. This is what the front looks like, and then the back. Super high quality joggers right here. So this is definitely a 10 out of 10. Okay, so this next item is another t-shirt. This one is the Letter and Butterfly Graphic Long Line Tee in color gray. So from the very first t-shirt that I showed, it had butterflies on the back. This is the second product that I now own with a butterfly. I just think these are so cute. The only reason why I picked up this one was because it was on sale. It's normally $11.00 and it was marked down to eight. I know that's not much of a difference, but look how cute this is. I couldn't resist. I think it's gonna be such a nice shirt on. This one feels more of a cottony feel rather than all the other ones in my first video. They were very soft and like stretchy. So I think this is gonna be very comfortable on. So let's try this one on now. Okay, this is what this top looks like. Really liking the material on this one. This is another one where it's the cotton feel rather than the smooth and buttery feel. This is what the front looks like. I really like how I have so much movement in this. I love oversized t-shirts. I don't think I'll ever wear another t-shirt that is actually my size because I'm so used to oversized t-shirts and I just like how they swallow me and they're super comfortable. So this is the front. I love how the butterfly stands out. It's a really nice color up against this dark gray. So this is what the front looks like. And then the back, nothing special, but I just loved oversized t-shirts in general. So I give this another 10 out of 10. All right, so for the next item, since it is becoming fall, well, probably not for another month, but it is getting into the fall months. I got this cute little long sleeve ruched front top. This is the solid drawstring ruched front crop top in color light gray. So it looks really cute on the model. When I pulled it out of the package, it doesn't look as cute, but I think it's just because this isn't tied up and cinched like it is in the model. But I thought this would be super cute for like fall and autumn wear when it gets a little chillier outside because I'm going to need something on my arms. But this quality is very nice. It's thick. I think it'll keep me warm, but it is more of a sweater material. So I wouldn't wear this in winter just because of the airflow through the arms and everywhere else. I would wear this when it's probably about 60 degrees outside, not 30, but 
Let's try this one on because I am super excited for this one. This is what this top looks like on. I paired it with some jeans just because I think these colors complement each other very well. But actually, I'm really liking how this looks on. When I pulled it out of the package, I thought, mm, I don't think I'm going to like this very much. But once I have it on and I got the ruched little front part right here, I think it looks very good. It is a little bit of a thicker material, so it is kind of hot. So I would say wait till like September or October to wear this. But I wouldn't recommend wearing this in like December or January just because this is the sweater material and has little holes all over it. So you might get a little chilly. But other than that, I think this is a very perfect staple piece for your autumn, fall seasons. This is what the front of this shirt looks like and then the back of it. So yeah, I definitely give this a 10 out of 10. Okay, I'm actually really excited for this item because I can start wearing this now. So this is the Letter Graphic Baseball Cap Black. And I always loved wearing hats to college just because when I don't feel like waking up in the morning and doing my hair or makeup, I can just slip on a ball cap and I'm good to go. So here recently, I haven't really had a ball cap to wear. So I saw this on Shein and I was like, this is super cheap. So I'm gonna pick it up and I actually really like this. I thought the only thing, this would be like embroidered on the front, but this is more of like a vinyl sticker which I don't have a problem with. I think it's gonna look good on either way. So I don't know if I'm gonna try this on for you guys just because my hair looks good right now and I don't wanna get hat hair. But that's what this one looks like. Super excited to wear this. Yay! Okay, so for the next two items, these are jeans. I absolutely loved my jean shorts from the first haul, so I thought I'm gonna try out some jeans. So these are the first pair. Can't, don't know if you can tell on camera because it's a wide angle, but these are the Ripped Detail Mom Jeans in color Light Wash. Super cute. The material is so thick. Like, these are thicker than most jeans you see in, like, TJ Maxx or Target or Walmart. But, like, these are some high-quality jeans. I'm really excited to try these on. I really liked the denim jeans in the first video. So, this is the back. Cute. And the front. So let's try these on. This is what these look like on. So first things first, I noticed that they are a little baggy in the crotch and they are a little baggier on my legs below my knee, but I think that is just because they are categorized as mom jeans, which is not a problem. Um, these are actually better for when I'm going on like a huge feast and I eat a lot and then I bloat. So actually the baggage and room in the crotch area might not be a bad thing at all. But this is what the front of these look like. I love the ripped knees. So these aren't as big as holes as the other jeans were, so no complaints there. I love any type of ripped jeans in the knees. The front of these look pretty good, and then the back is what this looks like. So overall, besides the baggage, I give these jeans maybe a 9.5 out of 10. Okay, so for the next pair of jeans, these are another pair that is light wash. These are just a little different on the knees. I really love jeans with just the knees cut out. I don't really like all the thigh and then the all the way down to the ankles cut out just because I really don't like all my legs showing that much because the point of jeans are to hide your legs. If you wanted to show your legs, you'd wear jean shorts, but that's besides the point. These are called the high waist ripped straight leg jeans. So these are also on sale. These were normally $25 and I got them for 19. And so when I saw these, I was like, these are the perfect jeans that they fit my liking of category. So I was like, I'm gonna put these in my cart and see what these look like. So let's try these on compared to the other ones and see how they differ. This is what the straight leg jeans look like on. I'm really liking how they fit. Most of Shein jeans that I've ordered in the past are super baggy in the crotch area. And these actually fit me to a T. They are very high waisted, which is what I love. I don't think they are very tight at all. I think they actually fit me well. This is what they look like from the front and this is what they look like from the back. I think these fit me perfectly. I love how these fit. I don't think I have any complaints about these. I love the holes and the knees just to give me a little air throughout if I get a little warm. These aren't long at all. They come right to my ankle which is what I love. With short legs it's really hard to tell what you're going to get online so I think these actually fit me perfectly. So I give these a definite 10 out of 10. Okay so for this next item I have actually been eyeballing this for a very long time now. I thought it would be perfect since I'm going back to school and I think this is going to be good whatever season it is. This is the Solid Drop Shoulder Zip Up Thermal Hoodie. And with colleges always keeping their air conditioning up or down, I get cold in class sometimes. So I thought it would be perfect to get a hoodie 
that doesn't just pull over like a sweatshirt, just something I can slip on easily and like wear open if I'm feeling a little toasty on the inside. But I've never had just a plain zip up hoodie. I always wear sweatshirts like crew necks. And also crew necks don't have a hood like this does. So I was very excited to pick this up. It is very soft on the inside. It's fleece lined, which I love. So that'll keep me nice and warm. Um, I can actually like use this as a blanket and fall asleep because this is so soft. I'm really impressed by the quality of this. So so let's see what it looks like on because I have been dying for this to get here. Okay, so this is what this jacket looks like on. I'm absolutely in love with this. So like I said, it has fleece on the inside, so it'll keep you super warm during those winter seasons. I love the look of this. I got a medium and I'm super glad I got a medium because it's not too long and it's not too short. It is the perfect little size. I've never had a zip up jacket kind of pullover like this. I always just usually wear a sweatshirt, either a crew neck or actually that's the only thing I wear. I don't think I have have a sweatshirt with a hood so I really like that this has a zip up feature so I can just leave it open if I get too hot this has a hood so I can wear this if it's raining outside this is just a little good carry-on to take to college with you just in case it gets a little cold on the inside or if it starts raining you have your hood for protection but I am really loving this I give this an 11 out of 10 just because I love this and I've never had something like this before so I'm just fangirling over it oh, I love it it looks really good with this I don't know why I paired it with this gray top just because this is gray so I don't know if that clashes on camera but oh well this is such an amazing jacket go pick one up for yourself okay so this next item I was super excited about I'm not going to be trying this on sorry guys this one is just for show because I don't want to be a little scandalous on my channel but this is the contrast mesh lace underwire lingerie set in color hot pink so it comes with this little cute balconette kind of top. I don't know if that's the right word, but it's lace. It reminds me a lot of the Victoria's Secret ones. So that was the top and these are the bottoms. The bottoms feel a little cheaper, but I think that's just because the quality of Shein lingerie is not the best. I mean, it's not Victoria's Secret. You're not paying $100 to like $150 for a set. But I just think this was so cute. I wanted to try it out. This is the back. I hope this is the right size just because you can't order lingerie pieces separately on Sheen. So like I'm a small in the chest but a medium in the bottoms. But they didn't give me the option to do that. So this is a medium set. So hopefully this will fit. But I will try this on away from the camera. And sorry about that guys. But yeah this is this super cute. I'm in love. Awesome. Okay so this next top is kind of similar to the one I have on right now. It is a gray tank. This is the... She in petite solid crop tank top in color light gray. So I love crop tops. I think they're so perfect for summer. Um, this one is petite. I don't know what the difference is between regular and like petite sizes, but I am a smaller person. So I decided to try this one out and see where they differ because I have a couple of crop tanks from Shein that are not petite. And so they don't look very much different but I'm just gonna try this one on and see where they differ but I actually don't think there's a difference at all but super excited to try this one on very high quality it's cotton I thought it was gonna be ribbed but actually I am happy it's not because seeing this in person I think it's gonna go very smooth and look very good with jeans so let's try it on okay so this is what this top looks like on I really like this actually I don't know what the difference is between petite and regular but I think the only thing that I noticed is it's a little tight up around my neck so it doesn't really cut down too low in the front which I really like about that um, I think it sits a little higher than most crop tops too because on regular crop tops I want to say they come down right at my belly button and this one sits right above my belly button so it doesn't have any like um, wrinkles right here because most of the time when I have a crop top I have to like ruffle it up just a little bit to get it to the length I want it to and this one actually sits where I want it to I think if it's really good it's very comfortable I love that it is cotton and not ribbed because some of the ribbed um, crops that I have usually have some more of the stretchy material in them but this one is just like feels like 100% cotton. I love the way this looks. It's super soft. This is the front and then this is the back. So I give this top a 10 out of 10 definitely because it's just super comfortable. For this next item, I am super excited. I probably say that about all of these items but this one in general is a sports bra. This is the Glow Mode Zip Front High Support Sports Bra in color black. 
So, as soon as I saw this, I was like, this looks just like the Victoria's Secret knockout sports bra. And those at Victoria's Secret are, I think, $60 to $70. And this was only $29. So that's, like, not even half the price. And the support is a little different. They actually have a bra inside of the one at Victoria's Secret, whereas this one does not come with an extra bra. It's just highly padded on the inside. But I like how it has the zip up. The back is very cute. It's the strappy back. So I think it's going to look nice with anything that you wear with an open back. But very, very impressed by the quality of this bra. So I'm probably not going to try this one on camera just because it is a little shorter than a crop top. But for y'all to see what it looks like, get a good visual. Because this is such a high quality bra. I'm very impressed. Okay, so for my last clothing item today, I have a cute crop top. This is a t-shirt crop and it is tie-dye. It is so freaking cute. This one is the soft material like I was talking about in the first video. It says honey on the front. This was also on sale. Actually, no, it wasn't. They had other colors that were on sale, but I thought this color was the prettiest, so I had to get it. This was only $7, but this is the Shein Honey Graphic Tie-Dye Talk in color blue. Super cute. I think this is going to go really well with those joggers that I got just for a more casual laid back kind of look. I'm really excited about this. I got a large in this and in my last video I got mediums, but actually as I've been wearing both of the shirts comparing them, I like the look and feel of the larges better, which you probably wouldn't be able to tell a difference, but with them on me physically, I could tell a difference just a little bit and I liked the feel and look of the larges better. So I got a large in this. Very excited to try this on, so let's try it on. Okay, so this is what this crop looks like on. I really like this. It is super soft and comfortable. Like I mentioned in my very first videos, this is one of the shirts that has the very soft and buttery material, which is super nice sometimes if you just want to feel really relaxed. And this shirt is making me feel that right now. I feel like I could just lay down and go to sleep. It's very airy. I really like how this top cuts off right at the top of my jean shorts so I don't really have much stomach flash. This is the front of this one. I think you can pair this with either jean shorts or actual jeans and then wear some white tennis shoes because I think that'll accent the white in this shirt really pretty. So this is the front and then this is the back. So I'm really liking this. I give this a 10 out of 10. Okay, now it is time for accessories. So I have an Apple Watch. I normally only wear my Apple Watch while I'm at college or if I have a job that is in person because I like to see what is going on my phone if I cannot have my phone out. So I got a couple of Apple Watch bands. This is the two-in-one solid watch band and case compatible with Apple Watch in color white. This is what that looks like up close. Very, very rugged style. I love the style of rugged watches. It is kind of a silicone material. I like it because it reminds me of the G-Shock watches. I actually had a G-Shock watch and I loved it to death. I like the bulkier look of them. I don't know. I'm just... I've never worn fashion watches. I like more of the athletic style watches. So I decided to pick this one up. Your little watch face goes right into there. I hope it fits. I picked out the 38 millimeter band because that's the size of my watch. And so I'm excited for this to try on. So I really like the feeling of it. I think it's gonna be very comfortable. So 10 out of 10 on this watch band. Okay, so I actually have another watch band. This one is the One Piece Clear watch band compatible with Apple Watch in color clear. I love the rugged style watch band, so I had to pick up this one. I really like clear watch bands. I've seen a lot of people with clear watch bands, and I think it just makes it look so good with their wrist and skin. So I decided to pick this one up. It looks a little different in picture than it does here. I didn't think it was going to be this blocky, but I don't think you'll notice it when it's on. But this is what that looks like. Again, this one just... Your watch face slides right in. I hope it fits, but I give this one maybe an 8 out of 10. I think I'm going to like this one a lot better. The only thing is about this one is since it is white, I'm very afraid that it's going to get dirty easily. That's why I picked up this clear one because clear doesn't show dirt as much as white does. So I'm going to try this one out first, and if this one gets dirty, I will switch to this one. 
Okay, so the next little accessory I picked up is the Kids Anti-Static Hairbrush in color green. So I thought this was such a cute size to keep along with you when you travel, especially to keep it in your purse. And since I will be going to college and I already have a lot of textbooks and everything else in my backpack, I thought this would be very convenient to keep with me on the go. Just because since I already have so much stuff in my backpack, a full-size hairbrush will take up a little extra room. So this one can be either in my purse, in like the little cup holder on the side. And I've actually had one of these before from Shein and they hold up so well, I just don't know where I put it. So I had to get another one. So this is a very, very sturdy brush. Like I don't even think I can bend it. It's very thick, high quality material. I love the bristles. The bristles remind me of the wet brush that um, you can get at Ulta or any retailer that carries brushes, but awesome brush. I give this a 10 out of 10. Okay, so I'm excited about this next accessory. I love jewelry and Shein has had a lot of good jewelry. I just don't recommend the rings just because they're not real or genuine. So they can turn your fingers green um, based off how your skin reacts. Mine reacts like within the first 10 minutes of me wearing it. But I haven't had any bad luck with their necklaces. So I decided to pick up this. It's super cute. It's a double necklace. This is the Star Charm Layered Necklace Silver, one size. And it is super cute. I don't know if my camera's gonna focus, but it comes with two chains with two silver stars on the end. I love star necklaces just because they're so retro and I think they are super cute and they pair well with any kind of shirt you're wearing, whether it be a casual t-shirt or something dressier that you're going out on the town for. So I'm really happy about this purchase. I cannot wait to wear it. Okay, so for the next two items, this came in a set of two. These are butterfly hair clips and to be specific, Specific, these are the two pieces butterfly decor hair claw multicolor and I've actually never worn a hair claw in my hair before and that is the latest trend and I decided to hop on the bandwagon and try this out because going to college I really don't want to wear my hair down every single day or sometimes I don't even want to wear it in a ponytail so with these clips I can just throw it up and then clip it in and I've seen a lot of cute styles with these ends so if y'all have any suggestions or any tutorials or any videos that you think are cute with any kind of hair clip drop them in the comment below so I can go check those out because I've never worn any type of hair clip like this before and so I'm kind of new to this whole hair clip thing which is why I got some more. I got these! I love the tortoise ones. These are the two pieces tor tortoise shell. I do not know how to pronounce that. Tortoise shell pattern hair claw in color gray and these are a little bigger than the other ones. These are more of the ones I've been seeing in like boutiques and TikTok viral like these are the ones that you can put vertically in your hair and it look really good I don't know what I'm trying to say but like I said I'm new to this so I'm really excited to try both of these out including the butterfly ones so like I said if you have any videos that you would like to share on your favorite styles with hair clips please leave them in the comments below so I can go check those out but that is everything I think overall this haul was very successful I think I got everything in within a decent amount of time everything was super good quality in this package I will say the pants though so leopard pants were a little thinner than I expected, but hey, out of like 30 items with one only being a little lower quality than I expected, I think that is a very good Sheen haul overall because most of the stuff I've ordered on Sheen within like four or five years ago, there was maybe 15 out of the 20 items that I have ordered that have been low quality. So Sheen has very well much upped their product quality, I would have to say. But thank you guys so much for watching. I am so, so, so super excited with all of these items. I will leave a link to each item in the description below so you can go check that out for yourself if you want to purchase anything. Hopefully within this video, I left a good amount of reviews so you don't have to go look through all of the reviews because some of these products on Shein have over 3,000 reviews. And that's why I like to make these videos so I can just elaborate everything in one video so you don't have to go scrolling through your phone for like 30 different products because I had a lot of products in this video. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really, really love doing this haul. Shein hauls are one of my favorite things to do, although they can be a little pricey, but you get lots of items for a good price. Whereas I got, I think 25 to 30 items in this haul and I only paid $225 and you cannot get 25 items anywhere for under $200. Like you can get maybe two items from American Apparel for like 100 
or maybe 150 but I think Shein is a really good quality website if you are kind of trying to lowball it if you have a budget or anything in that category. And the clothes are much better quality than they used to be. But like I said at the very beginning of the video, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, comment any video suggestions you want to see in the description below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.